A decorated El Dorado County Sheriff's deputy who served on a drug task force tonight is accused of dealing drugs. The deputy is out on bail facing drug charges. We sent CBS 13's Nick Janes to the deputy's Gardnerville home in Douglas County, Nevada. New tonight, he's there with why neighbors suspected drugs. Neighbors say the deputy lives in this quiet cul-de-sac with his girlfriend. It was a 911 hang-up call that brought investigators out here last night, a night that ended with the arrest of one of their own. It's an arrest that seems unlikely for so many reasons. Not only is Mark Slendick a longtime El Dorado Sheriff's deputy, he was assigned to SledNet, a multi-agency task force dedicated to taking drugs off the streets. Now the deputy is accused of dealing meth after an alleged domestic dispute turned drug bust at his home in Douglas County, Nevada. One, two, three, four cops pull up and the man is standing outside. It was hard to miss the commotion Tuesday night in this otherwise peaceful retirement community. But man, there must have been 11 sheriff's cars. You know, all over. Rick and Susan Zaliga immediately suspected drugs. The surprise? Who the suspect is? I saw him take the dog out of the, the squad car, and then the dog went into those bushes over there and sniffed and sniffed and sniffed. The dogs barked. Mm -hmm. I know police dogs are trained to bark when they find something. And the Douglas County Sheriff's Office says they did find drugs and drug paraphernalia inside the home of a lawman who as recently as 2013 was awarded Crime Scene Investigator of the Year by the El Dorado Sheriff's Office. We don't have to talk to this guy. No, I'm not going to. Let's just go in the house. Outside the deputy's home today, several people rushed inside, refusing comment. You guys have anything You're to say about the arrest? Absolutely, absolutely no. nothing. Deputy Zlendick himself was nowhere to be found. He's free on bail as he prepares to face drug charges that could put him away for years. The El Dorado County Sheriff's Office said in a statement today, the deputy has worked there since 2004 and they say he has been placed on paid administrative leave pending the outcome of this investigation. The deputy is facing charges of possession of a controlled substance, trafficking meth, conspiracy and possession of drug paraphernalia.